Pregnancy causes physiological changes that affect the level of hormones produced by the thyroid gland. Thus, you may develop thyroid disorders or pre-existing conditions can get worse during pregnancy or postpartum. In pregnancy, thyroid hormones are involved in the development of the brain and spinal cord of the fetus. Too little or too much thyroid hormone caused by physiological or an undiagnosed thyroid disorder can potentially lead to problems with conception during and after pregnancy. If you have an underactive thyroid, you may not be producing sufficient thyroid hormones to accommodate the increased need for you and your baby during pregnancy. The fetal thyroid does not begin to secrete significant enough amounts of thyroid hormones until up to approximately 20 weeks gestation. As such, during the first 20 weeks, the fetus is reliant on maternal thyroid hormones across the placenta. Untreated hypothyroidism can increase the risk of miscarriage, anemia and premature separation of the placenta from the uterus in the mother. It can also lead to premature birth and low birth weight in the neonate, lowered IQ score and impaired neuropsychological development later in life. If you are adequately treated, then these risks are the same as for women with normal thyroid function. With hypothyroidism, as soon as you know that you are pregnant, it is best to discuss with your doctor. It is usually recommended that your levothyroxine dosage is increased. You will most likely return to pre-pregnancy doses after delivery, and breastfeeding is safe while taking levothyroxine. If you have a history of thyroid disease, you should consult your doctor as soon as you wish to become pregnant to make sure your treatment is optimised to prepare for pregnancy. You might require more frequent follow-up for monitoring. If you are pregnant and suspect you have a thyroid disorder or you have existing autoimmune diseases, please visit the GP for further assessment. For more information, please visit the BTF website by clicking on the link in the description below. You can also watch our previous videos on the thyroid disorders by clicking the link in the description. Thank you for watching.